Brian loves that open. <laughs> I did. It reminds me of a sitcom. Yeah, it's a Honey, I'm home. That's What's for dinner? <laughs> Honey, we're home. Open What's the refrigerator. <laughs> it is 6 o'clock here in New York City. It is Friday, June 14, 2024. Welcome to Fox & Friends. Well, another awkward moment. Yep, uh, I'll show you what that is in just a moment. Fox & Friends starts right now. Remember, mornings are better with friends. Get dressed. Action. Okay. It's easier to commute. Well, I think our bookers ask every day, too. Okay. Uh, we ask every day, and there, she shows up. I say yes, please, and thank you to appearing on Fox and so, Friends. Oh, okay. Yes, great yes <laughs> guys. All right, we have some more news to get to, starting with a Fox News alert. A detective in Scott's phone use, because smartphones, there's so many dangers and things that go along with all well, of that. She's and of course, the, we've been covering. Yeah, she's been in the right state. You know, it looks like New York's going to be the first, Carly, to have some type of age limit uh, to, to use a uh, iPhone if this passes the legislation. Well, and, we've, and we've had... We've had uh, people on the show uh, who have talked a little bit about how, you know, you think the, the smartphone's going to make you smarter. It actually rewires right. your brain. And I was reading in, she posted that on Instagram. I was reading some of the comments, uh, Carly, and one of the people said, I gave my kid a flip phone and now he's paying attention to me. I like yeah. the idea. Do you so, think parents are going to do it, though, for the young people? I think so. people like that, it yeah. really matters yeah. because people think about mm -hmm. that. Go ahead. What Thank do you, think? you so much, Carly. Yeah. Um, the phone, if you scroll through his pictures, Jerry Seinfeld's, oh, actually, Jessica, it's Jessica's, um, mm -hmm. as she just pointed out, it says it's a phone, an alarm, directions, music, notes, and calendars. So no social media. And he said, as I posted earlier in my stories, we gave him a flip phone for graduation in hopes he will turn in his smartphone. So he already has a smartphone. Right. Many of you have asked if this is his first phone. I wish if I knew then what I know now, I would have waited until age 14 to give him a smartphone, but he had to have one. Right. 14 is what? It's, it's, called, it's called the Light Phone. The Light Phone 3, if you look on their website, it used to be $800. They, it, there's a line through it. Now it's $399 valid through July 15th. All right. But you know why? Because the smart iPhone has wiped out small talk. If you have something to say, the phone goes down. People don't but the small talk, hey, how you doing? Nice outfit. What goes on? Like, I never would have commented on your pants unless I put my iPhone on. These are, your pants look very good. Thank you. Two-tone is very Friday. Yeah. This is the Friday. first time you put lemon. Phone Don't down. they grab you? <laughs> no. Uh, Lululemon uh, Lululemon does not grab you. No. Right. Really? Feel, they have all, feel different, they're they're all different styles. All different styles. It's supple. It's all different styles. Uh, it is supple. Uh, all right. right. They're grabbing. From flip phones to flipping the ribs, let's go see, is who would be doing the grilling? Traditionally, man, yeah. like on Father Knows Best in 1950, the father knew everything. The father knew best back then. Mm -hmm. Then they realized he doesn't know best. We end up with Everyone Loves Raymond, where the father does nothing right. And but you know what, Brian? Our theme song now that we play at the beginning of the song. does remind me. Kind of yeah. reminds you of I remind you, like, when that comes on, I feel like I walk in the house after pretending to have a busy day. Here it is. And I hey, open the Father refrigerator. Knows Best. Right. Hey, Daddy, let's have but, something but to go I, outside and grill it. Dad, Honey, where's my dinner? If the dad did his job right, then he would have taught the son how to barbecue. That's, That's true. The, I'm not being But they're always on their iPhone. And listen, I got news for you, Lawrence. Yeah. My son is 35. He now knows how to grill. See? He learned right. at 35. See? All right. There you go. Um, and he's watching right I remember now. when you have to put on the coals, put them together, wait for them to get gray, then spread them out. Yeah, it's those are the days. These days. All right, uh, so we got a busy Friday. Thank you very much for joining us. Meanwhile, uh, this disturbing story is his birthday. He is 78 years old. Yeah. The house gave him a, the, the, was it the House or Senate that gave him a cake? I think it was the House. The house. That's birthday. the majority. Happy yeah. birthday, Donald Trump. How many Democrats were there to blow out the candle? <laughs> He, we don't know. He had, Just a <laughs> he had a sharp shirt surge in donations after his conviction, so mm -hmm. now he's right up there with yep. Joe Biden kind of money. Right. Uh, two, the two big dates. The debates, which we're going to talk about next week, and then, of course, July 11th. Yep. July 11th is a sentencing. Find out if he's going to be a free man to campaign. Yep. If he'll actually be able to go to the convention. Right. It's unbelievable. He might not be able to if he's on home confinement, which right. is crazy. Can you get <laughs> Skype in prison? Uh, good question. Uh, 7.15 now here in the East, and Carly joins us with other news. I do indeed, guys. Big story out of Texas that we've been following, a Fox News alert. and in So do be clear, it wasn't cracked up as you would think it would be because of the makeup. I always not wondered how those kiss. kissing scenes went. So that would be it, so awkward. I guess it's not glamorous. Right. That would be looks. so weird. Hold on a second. We actually had a kissing scene on Fox oh, and Friends. Oh, yes, we did. Back in the day, uh, we had yeah. Susan Lucci on. Yeah. Susan Lucci. Because I can relate to this whole thing. Was right. the star of a soap opera. Big fan uh, is Dawn we, Kill Me. And we made out. Because uh, I was in character. We, we <laughs> counted, no way. We counted down to the end of the program. And Brian the video's and available. Susan Lucci were going to kiss right at the end. Yeah. And did they? Well, here's the thing. I gave him a wrong countdown. 
Oh, so there's okay. 10 seconds left. I go five, four. So there would be minute. five seconds. And as it, I did, did you get a yeah. Yeah. guys. Did we should we should react the video because I was totally in character. I, didn't really I was. Guess. She kind of did it. Then. I well, couldn't. And I, I watched it back. Some... I couldn't believe how romantic I was. <laughs> I am <I'm> really. <laughs> yeah, my video later. Yeah. What was that about? Uh, she was looked in my eyes and saw something. <laughs> I, I, I did take acting class, laugh? and I had to kiss the guy in a scene. I was so nervous. I didn't even know the guy. Um, I, I drank before. I drank. <laughs> right. So you had alcohol breath before. I don't even it. care. Right. I was like, just get this over with. All right, let's I talk about. Take another class again. All right, let's talk about what's happening with uh, the WNBA. We know attendance is up, ticket sales are up, and it's Caitlin Clark. You watch is seven o'clock, Caitlin, and I call Uber Eats, and That's we'll right. have dinner. There you okay, go. That'll be fun. All right. All right. You call Uber Eats. I call the Macklemores. They're out on Fox Square, and they're cooking up a storm because it's Flag Day. Let's go, guys. What's up, y'all? Know we have. It is Father's Day this Sunday, and I know you grew up in such a unique situation, which we all wish we had grown up. Your grandparents lived right next to your parents or within a few few minutes? Yeah, uh, my whole family on both sides your grew grandparents up. grandparents and your grandfathers and your dad for Father's Day. Well, uh, I certainly Jacksonville, got Jacksonville uh, State University. You were a D1 QB when you were in college. How'd you go from there to music, and did you expect to be this busy now? I, I had no yeah, all, as many of them as I can. Yeah, gosh, I don't know how you do it. Um, fame, fame is difficult in many ways, wonderful in other ways. How are you balancing it all? Uh, in the studio, all the single girls are here to see you. It's uh, it, it was really gradual for for me. Congratulations, we are proud of you at Fox. Thanks for making time for us because I know you could have said no. You have so many things on your calendar, but y'all support him. Uh, Damn good day to leave is his new single. His new EP is way out. Kick off in November. You can go on his website and buy tickets. It's RileyGreenMusic.com. Thank you. They're performers. I asked him when the last time he was in New York City, and he goes, well, I was back here to be on this show. So, right. He said he is traveling all across the country. Well, he's I, I was, yeah, I was just looking. He's going to be at Fort Stewart, too, uh, because he plays for the Truth. That's a nice you know, crowd just, out there, too. Y'all, he just gave $50,000 to Folds of Honor. Oh, wow. Brian, uh, Fox News Alert, what is that thing on your lapel that is flashing? <laughs> still your microphone. Oh, you can <laughs> That's when he does the Instagram video. Oh, I yeah, I guess I was recording the whole time. Yeah. Um, Did you tick someone off? But this is no the, the Russians. The Russians are right. trying to find out well, what I... Well, take that I, off. We don't want anybody right. to hear okay. that. we watch the Chris Wig video. So we try to stream on 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 the on the Instagram site for Fox and Friends mm -hmm. and uh, my own. That's his kid. mic. Yeah. Do we keep everything going on every platform this possible? It's like streaming. a doll baby's mic. It's like a little bitty tiny. <laughs> We need like little doll baby hands. Just like it in front of you. You act like I put it so together. Maybe I engineered it. How tiny it is. Instantly, that is actually bigger than the one we're wearing. Oh, that's right. true. Oh, that's true. This is the real itty bitty one. Little tiny baby, 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 baby. Yeah, you're right. All right. Anyway. We should give this to Riley Green. He can go out on stage and just sing to this little tiny <laughs> <laughs> Brian's not happy. Right. No, I'm very Hold on. Let me make sure that I hide the this wire. Is so I don't cute. want Toba yelling at me. Is this, right. this works when you go, do you do live stuff? Apparently. Yeah. That is so cute. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. Perfect Girls size for love Brian. microphones because right. when we were little, we would take our hairbrushes and, you know, perform them. Yes, we did. Uh, yes, we did. You did no, too? Of course, my we sister did. Give me. Yeah. Okay, I got the yeah, solo. Yeah, you got to participate. All right. Uh, anyway, Riley's going to be singing throughout the hour. Yeah. If you'd like to see it live, go to foxandfriends.com. All right, got some news for you. Let's go. Carla Shepard. Good transition. Thank you, Brian. No problem. That is so it smooth of you. Us, right? Wow, I appreciate it. And I, I hope it's true. It is right. true. I, I guess jury's still out on that one. Yes. You never know what could happen. All right, you got some more news to get to. Starting in New York, where Governor's blushing. Oh, no. Your hand actually I, did come I am up. surprised how good I did that. Right. Right? I can't believe it. And she never calls. So I guess She's the one that's supposed to say that, Brian. Sorry. Must did not you, have been good. Did, did, did no. you talk to Don before you did? I mean, that's a lot of explaining to do. It was very spontaneous. I didn't have a chance oh, to get yeah. I don't know what to say. What did, no, what no. did John they, say? They might not have talked about it before. Right. They talked That's about it after. Right. Yeah, this weekend is going to be yeah, out was, and Good now, luck. She's Dawn's favorite it's actress. True. Yep. That's and a good there's point. her husband Ooh. making out with her. Right. I guess, yeah, it was a little bit good, a little bit bad. Hey, I heard you met Susan Lucci. Yeah, yeah the bad part I is you made out with her. You might, what do you do when you run into her? Because she lives out on Long Island. The chemistry just reignites. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You know what he'll it's say? It's like we never left. He'll say, I love Lucci. Uh, uh, that's good. Anyway, straight ahead. Good. Very nice. Hot yeah. lips. Uh, meanwhile, Hot lips. <laughs> it's, a, it's a battle we for big... All right. Amazing. How great was that, folks? If you'd like to help 
about Riley, and you'd like to know what he's doing. So buy tickets now. Well, he's going to be at uh, the amphitheater over at Clay's Park in Lawrence, Ohio, then Bloomington, Illinois on the 16th. Do you know you're going to be at Fort Stewart, the U.S. Army? That's music today. Yeah. Right. Riley, thanks so much for being here. God bless you. Have a great Father's Day, everybody.